Hello everyone. Today, Teacher Henry is going to talk about history of France. Enjoy the show. Teacher, can you talk about French Revolution? Of course, Helen. But first I need to talk about history of France. Where do we start? We can start Iron Age. In BC 51 Celts was living in French lands. After that, the Roman Empire conquered them lands and they entired to the Roman Empire. Had the Roman Empire a lot of lands in this years? Yes, Roman Empire was big empire. After that, barbaric tribes attacked this lands. At the same time, Franks procured these lands. And they established French Kingdom. So, name of French came from Franks? Yes, we can say like that. During the reign of Charlemagne, the Frankish rule in the region reached its peak. I say who is Charlemagne before you ask. He is the man who laid the foundations of today's France and took the lands from the Roman Empire. Born in the west of the Carolingian Empire of Charlemagne, the medieval kingdom of France gained importance under the auspices of the Capet dynasty, founded by Hugh Capet in 987. What about the Hundred Year Wars? The last real death of the Capet dynasty family member in 1328 led to a power of attorney that led to conflicts between the Valois dynasty and the Plantagenet dynasty, also known as the Hundred Years War. Officially, the war, 1337 single quote D6. Philip's Duke of Aquitaine, the heir. Plantagenet claimant of the French throne, 3. It started with an effort from Edward. The war resulted in the Valois victory in 1453. This victory in the 100 Years War has glorified French nationalism and strengthened the French monarchy, hasn't it? Yes, it has. France's political power, the Palace of Versailles, which gave the order, Sun King, 14. It reached its peak during the reign of Louis. Let's come to the French Revolution. Can you talk about Napoleon Bonaparte? Of course. French revolutions would not be without him. At the end of the 18th century, the monarchy and its affiliated institutions were overthrown by the French Revolution and became unpopular. Until Napoleon Bonaparte declared the first French Empire, the country was ruled as the first French Republic. After Napoleon was defeated by the Napoleonic Wars, France underwent several regime changes. Monarchy, then became the Second French Republic, the Second French Empire, followed by the establishment of a longer French Republic in 1870. We are coming First World War. Right? Yes! France took part in the Triple Entente during World War I. The United Kingdom, Russia, Italy, Japan. The United States and some small allied states fought together against Germany and the Alliance. France, too. Although it was among the allied states during World War II, it was captured by Nazi Germany in 1940. The Third Republic was liquidated, a large part of the country was controlled by the Axis powers, and the southern part of the country was left to the collaborating government of Vichy. The Fourth French Republic was founded after the Free France, which was founded in 1944, but it remained in existence for less than 15 years. With the Algerian crisis in 1958, the Fourth French Republic collapsed and the Fifth French Republic was founded under the leadership of Charles de Gaulle. With the decolonization movement of the 1960s, most French colonial empires became independent, while smaller regions became overseas states and overseas collectives. 2. Since World War II, France has been a permanent member of the UN Security Council and NATO. It played a central role in the unification after 1945 and contributed to the formation of the European Union. Despite the slowness of economic growth and problems with ethnic minorities, it maintains its strong economic, cultural, military and political importance in the 21st century. Here is briefly the history of France. Thank you for information about French history, teacher. You are welcome, Helen. Interesting of history is so important. You can go out, children. See you later.
today, Teacher Henry told about France history. Very nice. So, I can say something about this history? Oh, come on. For example, most visited country. France is still the most visited country in the world. Among the most important reasons that put him in front of the countries like America, China and Italy are Paris, the most beautiful cities of the world such as Lyon, Nice, Strasbourg, magnificent parks and gardens, picturesque French villages, unique beaches, skiing in the Alps, being Louvre in the first place, to host many museums and art centers. The country's extraordinary universal values allow it to receive over 80 million visitors each year, while Paris, the capital, is among the most visited cities in the world. The fact that France is famous worldwide in many subjects such as art, cinema, literature, music, fashion and education has played a major role in the visit of France by such a mass. 246 different cheese types. What? Is it real? Yes! Among the interesting facts about France, it is not to mention that the country has a worldwide reputation with 246 varieties of cheese. In France, pressed, soft and blue cheese, which is divided into three main groups, is produced from cow, goat and sheep milk. The most known of pressed or pressed cheeses are Cantal, which is a kind of cheddar cheese, French Comte, which is a kind of Swiss gravier, Emmental with holes, and round cheese mimolette, which is produced in the orange region of Lille. Soft French cheeses are produced in hundreds of varieties with unique characteristics of each region. The Nobel Prize in Literature is France. Yes, I know. In addition to Nobel laureate writers such as André Gide, Albert Camus, Jean-Paul Sartre, France, Alexandre Dumas, the author of The Three Musketeers, Antoine de Saint-Exupéry, the author of The Little Prince, Balzac, Montaigne, Émile Zola, Lamartine, Stendhal, La Fontaine, Flaubert, Victor Hugo is home to many famous names such as The author of the world's longest novel is French. Who is him? Written by French writer Marcel Proust, his novel In the Track of Lost Time Burr is composed of 1,250,000 words and is a total of 3,000 pages in seven volumes. Proust began writing the novel in 1905 after the death of his mother and died in 1922 while making his final edits. The novel, considered one of the greatest works of the 20th century, deals with the major social changes that took place in the period corresponding to the rise of the middle class in particular the collapse of the aristocracy. Oh, I saw it. But I didn't remember. Is there another information? Finally, to be in your mind, France is the world's first wine and liquor producer. French was used as the official language in England for 300 years between 1066 and 1362. The Louvre Museum was built in 1190 for defense against the Vikings. Paris was once a Roman city and its name was Lutetia. For more information about Paris, please see our Student City Paris article. In Africa, more people speak French than in France. Since 2015, fast food has been banned in France against obesity in restaurants. The Eiffel Tower in Paris is painted in seven years. The croissant, integrated with France, was originally invented in Austria. According to a decision taken in 1996, at least 40% of the music played on French radios must be of French origin. One million French, who live near the Italian border, speak Italian. Since 2016 in France, grocery stores have been banned from destroying unsold foods and instead it has been decided to donate to charities. Oh thank you Brett. You are my hero. You are welcome Helen. It's no problem. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget subscribe my channel and like the video.